What's happening, everybody? We back with another reaction video. We'll be reacting to Superpower Beatdown Deadpool versus Deathstroke. You know, it's one thing that's curious to me. I remember back in the day, back in my when I was boy. <laughs> but no, not not that long ago. It was like maybe two years ago, something like that. Two, three years ago. Uh, Superpower Beatdown was pretty much the place to go. Like, them and Screw Attack with their uh, death battle was still, they were pretty much both even. Like, you would see reaction videos, really, of both of them. Now, Superpower Beatdown, like, I don't see really anybody do a reaction for that stuff. I, mean, I know they took a long hiatus, like, what, like a year or something like that. They didn't, they didn't have any, like, Superpower beat down they had that uh uh thing with like um what was it? It was like uh superheroes go to therapy or something like that. But uh but anyway, I was I was wondering if they're gonna get around to this. Cause I know they had Deadpool and Batman and uh which I remember a lot of people got pissed off like Batman just shot Deadpool until he blew up. I was like, you forget Batman has machine guns mounted in his fucking Batmobile. And like, Batman shouldn't win Deadpool like this and that. <laughs> hey, it's, they, if you can, if you can, if writers can figure out a way to write Batman beating Superman, I'm sure there's a way for Batman to beat Deadpool. Like, <laughs> he beats a person who can literally kill him faster than a thought can travel down to his ass to just to, to shit his pants before he Superman just eviscerates him. Anyway, this isn't about Batman Superman. It's about the better characters, Deadpool and this <laughs> Let's get to the end to this. I should have set this up before I started recording. Well, anyway, of course, when I start, it's... It starts loading slow as fuck. It was loading perfectly fine before and now, so it's like, nope. Alright, here we go. Isn't oh, she dating now? Um, win in an epic, legendary battle. I'm Jennifer Van Dien, and we're here yeah, at Collector's uh, Paradise, the uh, greatest Casper Van Dien does it. I was like, what was his name? I know his name is Van Dien, but I couldn't remember his first name. The Terminator. The Terminator. Terminator. And then the other corner, defending Deadpool, we have Jessica, made of Oh, I've seen her on our Instagram. Amanda I've seen both of them. I've never seen her Deathstroke dark hair. Realistically win this battle. Slade Wilson was created in 1980 as a master level tactician. He's actually on par with the Dark Knight himself. And he has superhuman agility and strength, just like Captain America, who did actually beat Deadpool. Deathstroke is of course also Captain America a master swordsman Deadpool. and it's a Captain master America. marksman. Both way beyond Deadpool, Deadpool skills, and he even has his own healing factor, plus an armored suit. Deathstroke has single-handedly beaten the Teen Titans, the Dark Knight himself, and the entire Justice League. Deadpool is just a sloppy parody of Deathstroke, and you can't be oh. the original. I don't remember. Hey guys, I'm Jessica. I didn't read Deadpool, every comic. Those facts all sound... You know, okay. They mean nothing compared to the unbelievable, unpredictable, fourth wall breaking, chimichanga eating Deadpool. It is true, he is a ripoff of Deathstroke, but I'd argue he's a much better version. Now, he has some of the same amazing skills as Deathstroke, mm, that's debatable. but Deadpool's healing factor is arguably one of the best in comics. It's definitely history. funnier. At one point, he even regenerated from just a pool of his own blood. That's pretty awesome. It doesn't matter how great a fighter Deathstroke is, or if he looks good in an eye patch. At the end of the day, Deadpool's <laughs> unpredictable eye. nature is impossible to combat. He's taken down Wolverine, Spider-Man, the X-Men, well, like and he even if you killed can... his own comic writer. 
If you, you can you figure out a way to for any character in to be. Killer facts, but first, Hell, let's talk about today's sponsor. The whole we have this awesome universe. new app to talk to you about called Express. Yeah, and now it's time to enjoy this holiday themed super power beatdown. Holiday themed. Well, this is based on votes, so I'm sure Deadpool's going to win. Because I would argue he's definitely the more popular character. Baby, what are you thinking about? Somewhere out there, Aquaman is riding an armored shark. Hmm. But enough about him. <laughs> For Christmas, I asked Santa to get us the coolest gift ever. Oh. I like the Pikachu. That's a, that's a nice little touch. Hey, Santa, what's up? I've been kidnapped. What? Hold on, I'll be right there. Vanessa, that chick looks familiar, like I've seen her somewhere. I gotta go. I might have seen her on Instagram. Santa so. needs me. Where are you going? I'm coming, Santa! His healing fat is so good, he should be able to run without getting tired. Scroll under it. I really didn't want to get my so dirty already. I just had it pressed. Get this off. Missed opportunity. Hey, Spandex I'm pressed. over here. Ah, oh, Santa. How are you? Everything okay? Do I look okay? Uh, so this is the DC universe. I wonder if James Gunn or Joss Whedon has stopped by. Oh my god. <laughs> my Deadpool senses are tingling. I knew it hey, uh, my contract. Is his name Kevin to do Porter? Ridiculous to draw you out. But kidnapping Santa he plays Batman a lot. That's dark even for the DC universe. Oh, I know what you're after. You want the Snyder Cut. You know, I gotta tell you, you've had this contract for a long time. Been dragging your feet. This. Like a certain YouTube channel I know. Naughty, naughty. Anyways, I'm done monologuing. Huh? Deadpool shooting blanks? You think I'd come out here? Exposed without my helmet? <gasps> You're a hologram like Arnold Schwarzenegger in Total Recall? That's so cool! Wait a minute. <laughs> You're distracting me. Exactly. Uh, now the whole place gonna blow up. <laughs> Don't take cover by the house. Oh. Always in the ass. Every time. Oh, this is close. I really wish I had a futuristic sci-fi gun. Oh, wait. I totally have a futuristic sci-fi gun. Yeah, like, don't he have, a, like, a bottomless sack or some shit? Huh? You can just... I have to thank Cable for this awesome gun. Pull out whatever weapons he can think of. Like Inception or something. That's a big fucking dude. Uh, Kevin. Didn't he play? He played the Punisher when they did a the Punisher versus Red, uh, Red Hood. I almost said Red Dead. Uh, and uh, he played the Punisher. See how people get us confused. Our color schemes are totally different. Like they say in Japan. Dero Kukiwa. Okay. Utare Wu. Chow me with egg fu young and express me number three. I got a lot to get together for the dinner. Who's ever voice? Oh, 
such a second best. Second best? How dare you, sir? Other than my comics, I have two hit movies and portrayed by the sexiest man alive. You're just a villain on a CW show. Even when you're just a head, hey, you never show He's a good mouth. villain. Though. Actually, I like the this first one. Isn't that Menu And uh, Flash is just amazing. And oh my god, you have to watch Supergirl. It's so great. Season two gets even better. Terry Hatcher comes in, and you know she's OG, so she doesn't play around. Wait, you're distracting me. Oh. Yep, that's exactly Hasn't what I'm he doing. been shot in the head before? Yeah. Hey, Santa, got that super cool gift I asked for? Why is he moving his you get safe and sound at the North Pole? You want to come get it with me? Let's go. Why he do that to Batman when Batman blew his okay, ass up? Just no further. I shot him to death. He blew okay, up. No. Santa said he left it somewhere around here. Oh, there it is. Hold on, hold on. I'll get it. it. It's a little heavy. What? Oh my God. Merry Christmas. Open it. Okay. Told you Deadpool was gonna. Oh my God. Oh my God, God, baby, it's beautiful. Told you Deadpool was gonna. You know what they say. No gloves. This is no voted gloves. upon. It's of course, Deadpool. How did you get it from Thanos? How? Santa's a hardcore sorcerer. Took it right from him. So, now that you have the Infinity Gauntlet, what's your first wish? <laughs> Why in the name of all things good and decent will you get Let's see how the fans Deadpool voted. Infinity we have 44% for Deathstroke and 56% for Deadpool. Another win for Deadpool. There's a lot closer now than I thought it was going to be. Aaron. Hey everyone, just want to say thanks for watching this episode. Be sure to check out our next episode, which is going to be Remember people said that he was he was a skinny enough to be spider himself, Batman versus the King of Wakanda, the Black Panther. Be sure to get your votes for that. Black, Black Panther is going to win that. Also make sure you're subscribed to this channel and you ring that little bell so you're notified. I mean, I think he would win it regardless. And thanks to our friends because of the suit they have in there now for the vibrant suit. Secondly, isn't that thing insane? Because you can get your own at he's side popular as hell right now. Slash gauntlet. That thing is super cool. Now let's hear from the amazing actors who portrayed Deadpool and Deathstroke in this episode. Hi, my name is Kevin Porter. And you Kevin just saw Porter. me as Deathstroke. I know that I'm hard to recognize because then I, I, I had a patch on my eye. But now it's no patch. You may also recognize me from Dodgeball. I was laser again. No oh, yeah, I remember. General Hospital, Daredevil, a lot of cool things. But uh, He's in General Hospital. Batman versus Darth oh, Vader, where I played yeah, Batman. Man. Hey, guys, I'm Dirk Gullis, and I play uh, Boba Fett. Darth Maul, uh, I was in the most oh, really? commercials. I also played Deadpool for a lot of the productions of Stun Actor on there. And, uh, Is that the dude well from guy, Far Cry? Buddy, I'm Ryan Akaba, uh, voice actor, um, and I've been in Final Fantasy Type Zero as Nine. Uh, just recently, Just Cause 4 as Rico Rodriguez, go check that out. Um, and Ace Attorney Apollo Justice uh, as well. Okay, um, maybe. I like working for Batman the Sun because I could be the mouth okay, maybe he, for Deadpool. Wait a minute. He had to he's play the, that guy. The, from, he does the, uh, he's the he's the merc. Far Cry three. The the way. So he he, he even well. looks like the guy. And then I'm like, this is the voice okay. for me, and I do the body. That was, that's what I was saying. So I bet somebody so else is doing better, the voice. Yeah. Somebody else was doing the, um, the actual movie. Thanks everybody! Incredible stuff. That was Follow weird, us dude. on Instagram, <laughs> Bat in the Sun, so you can get exciting news and cool behind the scenes stuff. Until next time. I didn't know she got married to uh, Casper Von Dean. And now, how it does. Well, that was a cool little, a cool little fight. I thought, but I figured, you know, I, I knew Deadpool's on. Like I know these are based on votes. I knew Deadpool's on. Anyway, plus I, I will say. In a, if the fight is is drawn out, I think Deadpool will win. Even though I do think that uh, uh, I'm not forgetting his name, uh, Deathstroke. <laughs> I almost said Deadstroke. Deathstroke is is pretty much like a Captain America fighting Deadpool with a, with his healing factor a little bit better than Captain America. Because I know I've seen Death, Deathstroke get shot in the head and heal from it. 
but uh, but I think it was more like a graze or something like that. I can't remember exactly, but I know I read that somewhere. Kind of, sometimes I just read you know, the comments they have online. I'll skip them online, read them. Because the closest comic book store to me is literally like downtown Chicago. I'm not going there if I don't like going down there unless I have to. <laughs> Which I do for class sometimes, but not unless I have to. You ever been in a big city in downtown area? You know exactly what I'm talking about. <laughs> but anyway, that because the only thing I can think of with Deadpool is he's unpredictable. And he has that like bottomless satchel or whatever, bag, whatever he has. And his healing factor. But like in this one, if you blow him up completely, like he shouldn't even be able to move. But I mean, he won by vote, so of course he's going to want to do that. But hmm, it's hard. I still think Deadpool, it's kind of like the Hulk versus anybody. Like they say, if, it's like when people say Superman versus the Hulk, if Superman takes the Hulk out quickly, then. He can end it pretty much pretty quick. If the fight draw is drawn out and the Hulk gets time to strength increase, then he's going to beat Superman. At least that's what you know. That's what the argument is. In the same way. But yeah, I wonder what happened to the other redhead girl. Like, she probably still on here. Just because she was in the last one they did with. Uh, what was the last one they did? I'm not looking. At I, I, I know I look, I know I did a reaction to it, but I don't. I can't remember what it was. Cause now I'm thinking about uh, Daredevil and Nightwing, but that was on. That was a Death Battle. They did their first live action. Uh, Nightwing. I guess maybe the Death Battle was like maybe we'll move in and start doing this, and then Bad in the Sun start started back up again. <laughs> but uh, anywho. Uh, thanks for watching my video. I really appreciate it. Hope you enjoyed my reaction. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all later. Peace.